Hi, I'm Shayna King, beauty expert for Anissa International, and I'm very excited to talk to you guys today about our skincare brushes. Why skincare brushes, you ask? Well, we felt that we wanted to pair a system that went with the industry top trends in skincare to be able to create a luxurious spa type feel at home. And what that's going to do is it's going to allow you to apply less product and it's going to last you longer, which is going to save you money. And it's also going to not alter the product's consistency and formulas by adding unwanted bacteria and oils to the product that may be on your hands. We've created five brushes with five simple steps that you can follow and use every day at home to create a spa at home. Hi there. Again, we're going to be talking about the five-step process that you can use at home to create a spa-like experience during your daily facial routine. And the first brush is our pointed kabuki brush. And you'll notice the nice beveled tip. The reason we designed it that way is that the brush is going to allow you to work in areas of the face that are rounded and soft to make sure that you get a deep clean. And this product you want to make sure that you pair with your cleansers. Both gel or cream based will work beautifully with this brush. You can pump the product to the tip of the brush and then wet it and then start working the lather all around your face. Make sure that you go along the hairline in a circular motion you can even go on your neck and decollete area. The lather is going to ensure a full and deep clean. Make sure when you're done with your brush that you rinse it out thoroughly and dry it flat. The second brush is our flat top brush. And we created the flat surface because it's really going to encourage healthy stimulation in the skin. So you want to apply the product directly to the flat surface and apply in small, gentle, circular motions outwards toward the hairline. And the reason you want to make sure you're being gentle is we don't want to be too aggressive when we're applying exfoliating products. We don't want to cause irritation or redness, okay? So be gentle, circular motions outward towards the hairline. You want to make sure that you shake off the brush after too, just to make sure that you remove any excess product. And I like to even wet and dry this and then go over my face to make sure that I've removed any of the extra skin particles that could still be there. Make sure again to rinse and dry flat. The third brush is our foundation or paddle shape brush. And this brush is going to be great to apply masks and serums. Now you can dip the brush directly into your mask jar or apply the mask directly to the brush. And then you want to apply your mask outwards toward the hairline. And if you're applying your mask as well to your neck, just make sure you're applying upwards toward the base of the chin. Now, if you want to use this brush as well for serums, make sure that you clean this brush and let it dry thoroughly before you apply your serum. Same directional tips, okay? Working outwards toward the hairline and always rinse clean and dry flat. The fourth brush is great to apply your eye creams and eye serums. And again, you can apply take the brush and directly get product out of the jar or apply it direct to the brush. And you want to make sure that when you're applying it, you're patting it gently into the eye area. We don't want to pull or snag at the eye area because it's already sensitive. Okay, and then make sure too that you're applying to your upper lid as well. Um, serums, cream-based products are all going to be beautiful with this. You can also use um, for treatment around the nose area as well. And again, when you're done, make sure to rinse and dry flat. The last brush in our skincare brush set is our mini pointed brush. And this brush is going to be great with any treatment-based serums or creams. You want to apply the product directly to the tip and press or tap gently into the treatment-based areas, okay? This is great for around the nose, for blemishes, and you can even work your product into the corner of your eye as well. You wanna make sure that you rinse clean and dry flat. And I encourage you all to use your skincare brushes every day. It will really change the way your skin looks and feels, and your product's gonna last longer too. Thanks for stopping by.